they don't know your kids do not know the Lord first. Let's let's start there. Your kids don't know the Lord. They know how to um post up with their dick in the camera though and put their tongues out. And then you like to like play with your son for clout. Don't ever ask my son is he gay. Y'all, it looks like Rashawn Rock has finally seen the light. And I don't care what people say about her. I am here for this transformation. Well, I hope it really lasts this time. So, Krishan recently went on IG Live and blasted Blueface and his other baby mama, Jaden Alexis, for trying to mom shame her and go after her son. And honestly, I'm so happy she did this because those two can't keep Krishan's name out of their mouths. Meanwhile, Blueface is trying to force his other son to watch strippers at an age where he can't even process it. Calling him gay, having no food in his pantry. I could go on and on. By the way, did I mention that- Yeah, I saw those clips. I didn't really like those clips. Saw them on TikTok. Is trying to force his other son to watch strippers at an age where he can't even process it. Calling him gay, having no food in his pantry. I could go on and on. By the way, did I mention that Blueface and Jaden are now under investigation by child services? Honestly, I am so sick of this man. I've hated him ever since he filmed himself throwing cash at those poor people on Skid Row. And obviously, nothing's changed since then. And Krishan is now publicly calling out Jaden and Blueface. And no matter how you feel about Krishan and her past, it's obvious that she cares about her son. And it looks like having this baby has made her finally come to her senses. But in case you missed out on these recent developments, let me break all the mess down for you. And then that bitch dumb. Like, she's just dumb. She cool for you for clout and money, but allowing her allowing you to disrespect her kids in front of her. She weird. So you've probably heard by now that Krishan Rock gave birth to Blueface's son on Instagram Live. That's right. She live streamed the entire process. Wait, why does she have choker chains on? Can you give birth like that? What if something happens? I just saw it. I thought I should mention. On Rock gave birth to Blueface's son on Instagram Live. That's right. She live streamed the entire process. Like you're going underwater. Oh. No. Oh, there you go. That's a perfect cover. Yeah, no, she was healthy. Yeah, no, it's okay. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Yeah, okay. No, it's okay. Girl, you just started pushing. It's all right. You gotta be out the, all right, the next one. I got you. Krishan also named her son after herself, Krishan Malone. And honestly, I'm not mad at her because there are women out here naming their kids after a man who wasn't present for the entire pregnancy and has no intention of taking care of the child full time. So, Good for Krishan. Krishan was surrounded by friends and family as she pushed, and as for her baby daddy Blueface, he was nowhere to be seen. And it was later revealed that he was busy partying in Miami with his other baby mama, Jaden Alexis. So for those of you who don't know, Blueface has two kids with Jaden, a son Javon, who was born in 2019, and a daughter Journey, born in August 2022. Krishan got in the mix in 2020 when Blueface launched his OnlyFans reality show, Blue Girls Club, where a group of women were invited invited to Blueface's mansion for a month to compete for his love, and Krishan immediately stood out. While on the show, Krishan famously got into a fight with Jaden, but she still came out as the winner in the competition and was signed to Blue's record label. From then on, it has been pure chaos, and for almost three years, Krishan and Blueface were the definition of a toxic relationship. There were public arguments, physical altercations, arrests, another reality show, and a whole bunch of other mess. And then then in January 2023, Krishan announced she was pregnant with Blueface's child, but he denied he was the father and asked for a paternity test. Finally, in June, Krishan got results back from the DNA test and the test confirmed that Blueface was indeed the father of her baby. And while Blueface then apparently promised Krishan he would be nicer to her, it didn't take long before he showed his true colors again. Shortly after Krishan confirmed her baby's paternity, Blueface and Jaden went on Instagram Live and they talked about co-parenting Krishan's child if the baby got taken away from her. Like, the baby isn't even born and you are already making plans like that? Blueface was seen telling Jaden that Krishan would most likely F up and lose custody of her child. And since he has no interest in taking care of the baby, Jaden wow. would have to raise the baby. I think that we're gonna be in charge of the child. I think she's gonna do something too miscellaneous and we're gonna, well, adopt, we're gonna adopt the child. Start over. I think she gonna fuck up, and we gonna drop the child. If it's my kid, I think she gonna fuck up. You think? I, oh, I'm gonna take the baby here. I'm gonna take the baby there. She, wait, wait, I just saw. Also, she has a tattoo of blue face on the neck. 
yeah what is going on right now it seems like <laughs> yeah women young women you need to be very careful it's gonna go bad and we're gonna adopt a child i'm not gonna watch the child so you're gonna be stuck and also why are you child. saying this on live man i'm gonna bring the baby to your house like they gave it to me keep your family them. business to yourself bro you think i'm gonna watch your house child yeah if we together <laughs> <laughs> Shortly after this video went viral, Krishan also went on IG Live and said she was done with Blueface for good. And while she accused him of physical and emotional abuse, she also took accountability and admitted that she spent a long time turning a blind eye to Blueface's behavior and never set any boundaries. Krishan also said that she was ready to turn over a new leaf and was feeling very optimistic that her baby would keep her on the right path. I learned from my mistake. Bro, shit, I did. I learned where I fucked up at and how, how, how I didn't set no boundaries. Not for myself, not for you, not for anybody. I just didn't set no boundaries. I was childish. I was waking up every day going with the flow, praying, all his other shit, but I wasn't applying no word. I wasn't, I wasn't, really, I'm gonna I'm take accountability, bro. It's just all my fault, I swear to God. But I'm telling you, I was fucked up before I met him. Like, you know what I'm saying? Fucked up from my childhood. But he wasn't like somebody that really, like he, mm -mm. man, man. I swear to God, yeah, this my ears. Like she's hurt for real, for real. You can hear. I'm happy that I'm a mom. <laughs> I take back all the bad stuff I said. Of course, Blueface and Jaden then started yapping again on IG and they both shared stories claiming Krishan was lying about Blueface getting physical and accused her of being the aggressor. But then the whole situation took a very disturbing turn when a video emerged of Blueface and Jaden's son crying and telling Blueface not to leave because his mom would be mean to him once they were alone. Ooh. Bro, stop acting like that. Come on. Are you serious right now? What? You acting sad because I'm about to be right back? She's not going to be mean. If she means just call me. Okay? Okay. I'll be right back. I'm going to take you to school in the morning. Okay? You cannot tell me that this is a normal reaction because that child is clearly terrified of his own mother. And it's just heartbreaking to watch. The video sparked extreme reactions from fans, especially after Blueface had the audacity to say Krishan would lose custody of her child and asked Jaden to adopt Krishan's baby. I really don't like this, one fan said. CPS needs to step in. And another fan wrote, now we've seen a glimpse of the types of environments the kids are in. But what exactly is she doing to this baby when his dad is not around could just be a little discipline no kid likes that but this seems deeper also speaking of the environment blueface and jaden are raising their kids in these two recently came under fire after blueface brought strippers into his home with his six-year-old son present and then questioned the boy's sexuality blueface posted a series of videos on ig showing multiple scantily clothed dancers twerking in his living room alongside jaden in one of the videos blueface is seen leaving the room for the kitchen where his son is trying to find some food in the pantry and then blue proceeds to grill the boy asking if he is gay there's booty cheeks out here you in here looking for chip you ain't gay is you oh my goodness send that to a kid casual day son come here there's booty cheeks out here you in here looking for chips <laughs> and slim jeans hey. you ain't gay is you Huh? Hey, this happens Are you so gay? Real for real. You ain't gay, right? My man. My dog. <laughs> By the way, did you notice there was no food in that pantry? Girl, I can't. This just makes me so angry. And guess what? CPS is now investigating these two over their recent videos. According to a new report by TMZ, police and CPS have been called to Blueface and Jaden's home nine times since May. And they are now nine. investigating Blueface for bringing strippers around his kids. And while DCFS can't comment on specific cases, a source told TMZ that the safety and well-being of the children
children and youth is their highest priority. And the investigation is apparently underway. As for Krishan, she recently went on IG Live to let Blueface and Jaden know that she doesn't play about her son and told them she'd rather go to jail before she lets them take her baby away. Krishan slammed Blueface saying he's acting like a bitter baby mama while also blasting Jaden for not having a mind of her own and protecting her kids. You acting like that bitter baby mama shit. That's what bitches do. Females do that. They keep their, their kids away from their, their baby daddy because of certain reasons because they not getting along. She's just scared. She's She don't got to mind her own. Me, I got to mind my own and I got a big heart so I allow motherfuckers to manipulate me. Not for long though. I let motherfuckers walk over me, but not for long though. I let niggas drag on me, but not for long though. <laughs> Krishan then called out Blueface for using his son for clout and she got emotional while talking about how she would never allow Blueface to disrespect her kids the way Jaden does. And then you like to like play with your son for clout. Don't ever ask my son is he gay. And then that bitch dumb. Like she's just dumb. She cool for you for clout and money but allowing, her, allowing you to disrespect her kids in front of her. She weird. Why? Because I'm gonna go to jail for mine. You hear me? Let you play it about Junior, nigga. I'm going to jail for mine. I don't care for no clout, no money. Krishan also addressed Blue's comments about Jaden adopting her child. And she said Blue and Jaden both need to go away because they have no say about her baby. And what is going on in 2023? Like, I just don't understand. I'm watching these videos and it seems like I'm watching a movie. And this is like real life shit happening right now. <laughs> Oh my goodness, bring strippers to the house and ask your son if he's gay and why he's not there. Uh, well, let me know what you guys think of that. And also, everybody's going on live, call each other, you know, and talk about things. This is just like a communication thing. And, you know, establish co-parenting if, if that has to be. Like, I don't understand the whole situation. It just feels feels weird to me. This feels like a movie. This This should be fictional. Like, it shouldn't be happening in real life. Hmm. Let's keep going. Oh, take us. Let's you have it. no, you have no say. So don't ever, bro, bro. Nobody taking my kid from, bro. She's so hurt. You can Nobody tell taking from my vocal. baby from me, yo. Yeah, Nobody she's really hurt. Nobody taking my baby from me, yo. You know how much shit I took when I was pregnant with him. Nobody taking my baby, yo. So, go in over there and take that shit. You hear me? Like, So like I said, it seems like motherhood helped Krishan change her mindset. And I really hope she stays on the right path. And I'm not the only one who feels this way. Check out how fans reacted to Krishan's live video. I'm so proud of her transformation and growth, one person comment. When she talks about Krishan Jr., the emotion is so genuine. CJ feels her emotions. Where Blue had her nose wide open, he also made her eyes wide open. This is what God's grace, mercy, and favor look like. And another fan said, you know, I'm actually happy she got pregnant because I think this baby is in the process of opening her eyes up to what's really been going on between her and Blue, seriously. And hopefully it's gonna give her the strength to do what she needs to do for her and the new life she just birthed. But how do you guys feel about Krishan checking Blueface and Jaden for going after her son? And do you think motherhood has changed, Krishan? Let me I mean, motherhood has to change you. Fatherhood has to change you. Like, that's not a joke right there. So yeah, I agree with the, the person from the second comments that they like the fact that she got pregnant and she has a child now so yeah things are more revealing your priorities are gonna change now well I, I don't just understand what is going on in the world anymore like certain things should not be happening and if they do happen they should be fixed and resolved and um, behind closed doors a lot of things communication can probably fix you know talking and sorting things out because this is family at the end of the day like too many entanglements going on. It's family, so you want to keep it in-house and build your family like that. You don't want the, the basis or the foundation to be to be this. Imagine in 20 years and these kids all grow up and then these videos are floating on the internet and they have to see this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not that old, but some things I just, I just know should not be happening. Yeah, should not be happening. My grandpa had like three wives and 27 children or 23 children 
they don't even call each other stepbrothers. They grew up, they eat the same food, drink from the same pot, even with the conditions, the, the situation, like they were grounded. They would go out, if one person get, gets hit, they are all fighting together and imagine the whole crew fighting together. So yeah, all this division and separation, nah, is something that doesn't resonate with me. Anyways, just those are just my thoughts. Let me know what you think about this. Um, if you agree with any of them and you think <laughs> you think this is how things should be taken care of, let me know in the comment section. That being said, is the end of this video. Smash the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Have a wonderful day. Peace.